Hey, what's happening, everybody? We're going to show you real quick how to make your own uh, shortcut icons for your lean back launcher here. So you need a pen and paper. But what I, I'm going to show you real quick, the uh, DNS changer. This app right here. As you can see, we're on the default home launcher, and it's not. There's no shortcut in here, so you'd have to go into your settings, apps, open it that way. Okay. So first of all, what you need to do is go into the app that you want and write this address down. Take a pen and paper, write that address down. C O M dot A Y K U T C E V I K dot DNS changer. Or also, you can go into, if you have A to 64, go down to the apps, and then that same address is right here. So just write that down. So now we are going to open up our Google Chrome <coughs> and we need an image. So DNS, oops, DNS changer lily. And then we'll hit enter. And then I'm going to hit images. And you find an image that you like. This one looks like the one. Left click on it. Right click on it. Download image. And see how that's a dot PNG. So that's what you want. You need you need a dot PNG. But if that wasn't a dot PNG, then I have a site I'll put in the descriptions to convert that. So you just choose your file. If this was like a JPEG or something, you'd grab it, highlight it, open it, start your conversion. Once it's done converting, you can download it. And then that, that's done. Once it's converted to .png, we're going to open up this site. I'll also put this in the descriptions too. You're going to name it. We're going to put DNS changer. Oops. Changer. This app package. That's where you're going to write down that address. <coughs> so we're going to write down com dot a y k u t c e v i k dot d n s changer. Double check everything. K U T C E V I K dot D N S changer. Alright. So it's an app. You can pick apps apps or games. It's an app. And this is where it says PNG only app logo. So you're gonna choose your file. Done. And then this is for an app banner. If you just wanted a small little icon shortcut, you can just stop there. But I like the big full size banner ones. So I'm going to put it here. So I'm putting the same, same deal here and here. So let's name it, write the address, and put your images here. 
in both of these spots. You need it, the app logo, you have to have something there. But like I said, if you generate the APK, it's just going to be a little tiny shortcut. So I like to do the, the banner, the full size ones. I'm old, bad eyesight. Once you get all that done, generate APK. Once it says success, download APK. Hit OK. Open it. Install. Done. Hit your home button. Add your favorites. Boom. There it is. And you can put whatever image you want. Long press on it, move it around, click on it, and boom, it opens up. But you see how that, oh, I don't have any small ones. Oh, there's one. That one is just made with that logo, not with the banner. See how the icon's just real small in there? So to get the full size banner ones, you need to do the app logo and the banner. This is just doing the app logo. Same with this one. See how that's so small in there? So there you go guys. Easy peasy how to personalize your shield. And you can do anything. You could write your name. You could put a big capital R O N O R R I S just it and then just spell out your name if you want. You can put anything you want there. Doesn't have to be an image of the app, but I, that's just how I like it. But yeah, personalize your box. And then here's a way to I do to save them. Or if you have a file linked And then see how this is the app version 1.6. Any shortcut version that you make, it's going to be 1.0. So if you're wanting to put a shortcut in your file linked, drag and drop from your file manager. So now I have that shortcut in my Dropbox. I'm using the uh, Solid Explorer Pro. But I also like to back up my shortcut icons into my Google Drive lean back icons that I make. So all of these are all shortcut icons I've made. But it doesn't take long guys and it's an easy way to personalize your box. Alright. That is easy enough, right? <laughs> DNS changer. So yeah, even if they do have shortcuts and you don't like them, change them up. And that's for people that don't like to use side load channel to make, to create their own and just want something. But yeah, side load channel launcher, you can put whatever you want in there. But a lot of people like to use the Android TV Home, so this is a way that, to make your own shortcuts. It's easy. Alright, enough of me. Love you guys. Peace out. Happy streaming. Personalize those boxes.